Hi, this is George Steimer with Technology Services Group. In this short demo, I'm going to show a uh, experimental feature with HPI where we're editing documents directly within HPI. So here's an HPI folder. We're uh, looking at the folder. We can see the folder contents and some related folders. Uh, I'm going to go over to the actions here, and you know, one of the things you might want to do to a folder is add documents to it. Um, we have a typical, you know, choose a file, edit the properties, add one or more documents, and you can upload them. That all works great. But what we're thinking about is, hey, is there a way that you can edit documents directly within HPI uh, and skip the step of needing a Word document or Excel spreadsheet to uh, create locally? So we've created this create new document action, and when you click it, uh, it's going to ask us, okay, what's, what's the document type? So I'm going to choose SOP. And then we're envisioning that types could have configured templates. So for SOP, there might be two templates, but for other types, there's different templates. But for this demo, I'm just going to choose a standard SOP. And this screen allows us to edit the content and the properties at the same time. So I can go here and just add a title and maybe set a periodic review date to a date next year uh, and maybe set the site. And um, here is the content. Uh, we're kind of experimenting with how this will work. Right now we have this as a um, inline uh, version of the CK editor WYSIWYG control. Um, we could of course fall back to the more typical text area with a WYSIWYG control at the top, uh, but we think this might be pretty neat as well. What we're seeing here is that we're envisioning that maybe portions of the template could have different configurations like you know, this purpose, maybe I can only set uh, minor formatting, but in the overview, I have a more full toolbar. I'm just going to go ahead and copy some example text in here so we can uh, see some more realistic data. Just copy in the overview here. And now we're ready so we can see our content. Uh, down here, we've env we're envisioning that you might have a preview button that allows you to preview what the end result's going to look like. I'm just going to go ahead and submit. And uh, here's our PDF. So we've put the content into the repository and generated a PDF rendition. Um, you'll also notice that um, we have Open Overlay running to overlay the properties onto the PDF, just like any other Word document or document in the system. Well, that's it for this demo. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have any questions or would like to contact us for more information, please check out our website at tsgrp.com. Thanks a lot.